before it went home in the cities, we would just look around in our communities. <clears throat> Holiness is the very essence of how we're supposed to live on a daily basis. When everything else fails, mm -hmm. we look to holiness. Uh -huh. It's our sense of direction. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. So, when you get there, just say amen. 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 So, therefore, gird up uh -huh. the loins of your mind. Uh -huh. Be sober yes. and hope to the end of the grace mm -hmm. that is to be brought unto you at the revelations of Jesus Christ. As obedient children, not fashioning yourself according to the, the former lust in your ignorance, but as he which has called you is holy. Uh -huh. Come on. Y'all know who that uh, is, right? Yes. 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 Be ye holy in all manners of conversation. That's what the word says. In all manners of conversation. We got that twisted, ladies and gentlemen. We got that twisted. In all manners. That, that gives us no excuse. We can't go on and say, well, I've been like this for 20 years. According to your scriptures that you study mm -hmm. to show yourself approval. Amen. It's in, in all manners of conversation. Amen. That means in all things that we do, mm -hmm. we got to examine that thing through the eyes of holiness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a cliche that says holiness is next to godliness. Y'all heard that before, right? Amen. According to the Bible, that ain't even true. That ain't even true. Holiness is God. Mm, 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 mm. I'm just going to take my time. Take your time. I know I got 20 minutes. Okay. Because it is written, be ye holy, for I am holy. Amen. It is written, be ye holy, for I am holy. So, what does that mean? Be ye holy, for I am holy. We have to start learning how to walk in holiness. Amen. What is the first step that we must do in order to walk in holiness? Y'all write this down. It said, gird up your loins. Of your what? Let's go to another scripture to back that up. Okay? Let's go to Romans. I'm sorry. Let's go to Romans 12 and 2. And it says, and be not conformed to this what? World. But be ye what? Transformed. What that mean, y'all? Change. No, I'm, I'm, I've been like this for 20 years. No, change. change. Nah, shoot. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a Jackson. They don't know about me. Change. It said, be ye transformed by the what? Renewing of your mind. So what that mean, y'all? We have changed some things. Mm -hmm. Our community is failing because we have not transformed by the renewing of our minds. We've been doing things the same way for years. Where have these gotten us? Mm -hmm. look, at our, look at our communities, y'all. It's failing. Mm -hmm. Because we're not renewing our minds. Mm -hmm. And guess what that is, y'all? That's holiness. Mm -hmm. That's a part of holiness. Mm -hmm. So when you talk to your husband, a certain kind of way. Mm -hmm. How do you address them? Do you dress them with love? Mm -hmm. That's part of holiness. Mm -hmm. What about when you talk to your, your wife? Mm -hmm. How do you treat her? How, how, how do you act? That's a part of holiness, y'all. Okay. This is our guideline of how we ought to live and how we ought to do things. Amen. When you become in Christ, you're supposed to become a new creature. Oh. Old things are supposed to pass away. Oh. But some of us, we like to hold on to that oh, truth. Oh, shit, I was a thug in the world. I'm a thug of Jesus. Come on, come on. God don't need thugs. You need warriors. Amen. 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 Am
people that know how to fight. Yes. Demons. Yes. Any demons that understand that this is a spiritual warfare. Yes. And guess what? Holiness is going to give you that balance that you need in order to obtain 